guys. Boo you. What's going on guys, Bodie and welcome to another PK commentary. Today we will be PKing on the Zerka. Two things I would need to say first of all. Firstly, I had a horrible night's sleep. Let's just leave it at that. So naturally, I decided to make a PK commentary. I really don't know why, but I've not got a PK commentary out in a while, so I do need to get one out. Secondly, uh, I have seen a couple of people saying like, why is like every video I upload at the moment on other people's accounts and not my own? Currently, obviously, I can't really PK on my Void Ranger, and it's extremely boring to live commentary on Boaty because the fights are so slow paced. It's literally I've tried to I've tried honestly so hard to make a Dara commentary. It is just zero 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 zero, then thirty twenty, and then you axe both zero, boom, repeat that, and then eventually I just die. So I really I don't I can't say I don't enjoy making commentaries on the account. But it's just, I feel I can make better commentaries on these accounts. So that's kind of why I do it. I feel these are way more enjoyable to actually probably listen to, really. But today, we've got some Dragon Longsword action. So if this guy fights me, we've got an instant fight, and that is awesome. I'm actually doing uh, pest control on my other account at exactly the same time as PKing. So if I click off over here and then end up dying, it will be pretty bad. But I don't know if this guy's going to fight, so I'm going to quickly save this clip. And we'll be back in a moment if we find a fight. I'm not a voider. Okay. First fight, Void Ranger. I've already lost. Like, let's just face it. If we're prevenged, we might actually be able to kill him fairly early, so I might actually rush a spec on the nine of mine, because we hit sevens and zeros. Great. Why are you praying? Oh, of course, no smite. Okay. Why would you not smite? Where is the fun in no smite fights? Is he still praying? Okay, good. We're okay. Anyways, I don't want to die too early, because I'm still trying to get my void points. And if that causes me to misclick, then it's going to be really horrible if I die instantly in this uh, game. Please drink that brew. <sighs> Could have died there. Misclicks are bad. Just woke up. This is literally my first. I woke up literally 20 minutes ago, maybe, and this is my first fight of the day. So, as we can see, I'm clearly going to die at this rate because Void Rangers are quite overpowered, and that is exactly why I'm actually making my own Void Rangers. So, yeah, it should be fun. God, I just got to full HP. Don't hit a 42. And he's this extra guy. Pronounced that pretty well, I'm not going to lie, but. Yo, I just had to exist. Anyways, D Long Go. Let's see a 46. C38. No, he's 1 HP. Damn it. He's 1 HP. And he tabs. Come on, man. You just. Went he was just destroying me for the entire fight. Bam, I red bar him and I just teleports down. For anyone wondering how the hell I knew he was red barred, the recoil ring hit a two back on me. That means he's not dead because he does an 07. You can't deal damage back when you're dead. Oh, wasted sharks. He stepped up to the challenge. I'm pretty sure the clip is in the video. I was asking this guy to fight me. And he said, no, fight the voider. So we quickly, we quickly um, sorted the voider's face out and showed his true colors of teleporting. And here I want to eat. Because uh, I could have actually done... Could he have hit 39? He probably could have. I'll tell you what I can hit, though. A 35! And the Vengeance doesn't kill him. Come on, spec mode. Oh, 36 straight after the D-Long. So far, I've hit a 38, a 35, and a 36. This is looking like a good video, in my opinion. Beastly hit there. Absolutely. That's a great kill. That's a great kill, actually. Could have smited away, though. Smite would have whipped. Would have been greater. But, yeah. Anyways, good fight, man. And let's just make, let's make, a, good, let's make a quick comment. I'm just going to end the clip now, and I'll be back when I find another fight. That's how you make some easy money. Thank you, man. He has to fight me. And then this guy comes up saying I've got loot on him. And he just sells me out and fights him. Yeah, what a waste of potions. Okay, I can spy a rusher in the area. But I've not got a DDS, so I don't know how I could possibly de-long rush. But I'm going to give this a go. So I did actually half brew up for... Um, I was going to fight this guy here, who I'm going to choose instead. Because I really want to fight someone properly instead of rushing. So... Please fight me, sir. Just, just say yes. He said he was going to. Nice, 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 nice. Let's go. Good luck. No smite. Lame. Nice right, 50 prayer. Fair play. 3, 2, 1. Die! Let's go. Alright. Damage is going to be dealt. Are you ready for me to just get killed here? We'll see. Oh, I've got the first hit. And he's not dead because he ate food. Damn. Alright, I need to get back in my pest control boat. Go, go, go. If I die now, I will be upset. Oh, we'll eat it. <clears throat> okay. Right, we're now... Oh, it didn't even eat a... Yes, it didn't eat a shark. And I was thought I was going to die then. Real good. D-Long is hidden. He has no idea what is about to be unleashed upon his face. And it's probably going to hurt him quite badly. Assuming it hits. Which it probably will actually judge him for what it's actually hit so far this commentary. Which is actually quite nice. 43 is a bit low. So we might have to be ready to... 40 is... Eh, he won't hit a 40. But I don't want to be put down and have to drink a brew so early again. Go on then. We'll do this. Oh, I thought that could have killed him. That could have actually killed him. Like... Fair enough, it looks like it's impossible, but I've hit like 48s with the D-Long so far in um, this account, so that was easily possible, just unfortunately. Didn't actually pull through. Anyways, we've got a good situation there. If I can high on him, go straight for a Vengeance, and then we can possibly kill him. Unfortunately, we're not hitting anything, so we just got to wait patiently. Six on the Venge. Come on, here we go. This is it. 
He's only going to eat once, and he's going to take a... Wow, okay. He must have been a bit paranoid there, the D-Long. He must have been thinking it was going to hit high. Ah, no need for revenge there. Didn't hit anything. 20 prior points. We're all good. We're not in a smite fight here. Go on, D-Long. Oh, that's such a bad... That was a bad time to spec. This guy, I don't know if his HP is, like, really high or anything, or if it's really low, and his shark just heals him loads, because... I don't know why you'd brew in that. He was, like, 35 HP. Why would you brew, but... I don't know. I don't know. I could be wrong here. So we're going to have to wait. I don't know when I could spec him, though, because if I spec him when he's ready for it, he's probably... Don't hit a 38, please. Thank you. If I spec him when he's ready for it, he's obviously just going to heal with whatever method he's got, and that's healing him quite a lot of HP, so I can't out him. See? He's full HP again. How could I possibly kill this guy? Here we go. D-Long doesn't do anything today. If he hit my Venge, we could have had a better chance there, but he's just always really high HP. Come on. Come on. I'm Venge right now. I'm Venge. I might use the shark so my Venge can actually hit better on him, so let's get rid of it. And if it's like a 30 on me now, the Venge will hit really high back. Now it won't hit as high, but it doesn't matter, because we're going to... Oh, I could have killed him! Come on, these skip do it for me! Ah, oh, zero limbs. Right, this is where I always die in fights. I'm alive, I'm 1 HP. Run! Oh, uh, I'm alive. 1 HP, yes! Oh, no, am I poisoned? No, he has an unpoisoned dagger. Ha ha ha! You know what, I want that kebab. Come on, give me the kebab. Kebab. If that was a bad kebab, then, oh my god. <laughs> Rematches are a go-go. Look at him. Dropping my vengeance. That's my, like, my only chance to kill this guy is probably in the first 10 seconds of the fight. Just when he might not actually watch his HP for a split second. And I can deal a ton of damage with a couple of vengeances and actually survive. So, I mean, not survive, uh, kill him. Throughout the fight, though, every D-Long spec chance I got, he's got Kawambuans and... I don't know what else he's probably packing, but... Whatever he's got, he's proving very tough to actually be able to kill. Look, he's, he's back on full HP again. He ate a shark on like 70 HP. And he's just like, oh, where's my chances? He's definitely not going to risk this. So, oh, he did risk it as well. Wow, okay, there we go. So we did actually got a kill. Oh, we tried to eat. There we go. There's the Kowambwans. And it was just keeping him alive. I don't know why I don't really PK with Kowambwans on this account. I feel a brew is actually good enough with 95 HP though, so that might be why. But it doesn't even potted. He's got four of those potions. Unless he potted in the bank. Which is probably a silly idea, because uh, it depends how long it takes to get a fight. Obviously, I'm here waiting for him, so he can go straight into fighting me. But still, I don't know why the um, I don't know why you do that. I guess you get he doesn't even get extra food either, just because he has four those potions. Anyways, good fight, man. I actually didn't expect to kill him so soon, or like that at all, because he was pretty good with his eating when I was going to spec him. So yeah, that's pretty nice to get him. I didn't expect him to risk that either. Good fight, man. Go. It's been ages since my last fight, man. Like, I'm just, I'm suddenly awake, but I want some fast-paced action. I can't live stream if the wilderness is dead, but anyways, we've got this level 100 and, f oh, sorry, 100, what am I on about? This level 95 to fight here. Uh, I pretty much just logged back in, so unfortunately, we have actually, we prove prevenges are not built up, and there's actually four spinners around this portal on pest control, and it's not looking very nice, so... We should be alright here on healing up unless he rambos, so we'll double eat, get the prayer back to full. Now we're just going to wait for time for the D-Long to come absolutely slaying out. This is looking quite tasty. I'm going to do it, because if it hits like a 46, which it could have done, it would have killed him. And it would have looked beautiful. Unfortunately though, we don't get the 46, so we'll get it now instead. But oh, come on D-Long, do some good. You were doing sweet before. Pulled you out the bank and it's just like, go on then. We'll just do good so he keeps me off. He's 25 life points, how did I not skip that? <laughs> oh, damn it. Yeah, and I pulled out of the bank, first fight, boom, 38 red bar, second fight, 35, 36, whatever the hell I hit, I can't even remember. And he's now dead. Go D-Long! Oh, this thing is horrible right now. It used to be good. I'm just going to burn it. I might grab the D-Mace out and see what the hell that's going to do. Come on, we can do something with this longsword. I've put him in situations where if I actually got the hits, that's only like a, yeah, it's only like a 20 ounce, another two. Go for it, I don't even care. Oh, I misclicked and I don't want to waste my last spec. Oh, that's quite nice. Come on, Skim, do it for me. Zero, damn. I could have gone for the web, but there was so much time if you misclick for him to actually get a prayer put up that I probably there would have ended up wasting my last spec, so I didn't really want to... I could have gone for it if it like a... I think I would have had to hit like a 47 or something. I would have had to max to get it, but I felt that the odds were just too low and it wasn't really worth it. So if I double brew here instead of going for another shark, that allows me to shark and restore to get my prayer back up. And then we can get back in this fight slowly with potions. And then maybe we can get the other the smite. To Gurk again, we can actually get back down and smite him. I think we want to press give, give him press control. Let's go in there. Don't kill me. Thank you very much. Right, we must be both running low on food now, so I might have to... I've missed a hit there. Might have to get in a good situation here to get a kill. 46, but he's going to go for that. 39! <gasps> no! Two. He is, that's a whip. That is a whip. There is no doubt that is a whip. 
Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. What did he try and do then? I think he was... He, no prayer pots. No prayer pots left. He must have been scanning his inventory for a prayer pot then. Unlucky man. Good fighter. Whip smite on video. Beautiful. First whip smite in a live commentary right there. It wasn't on a live stream, so... Very happy with that. I actually finally got one. If he tapped... Oh, you don't want to know. We've got this guy. He's hitting hard, so he's not going to have prayer pot for a while. So we can probably not... Ah, oh, no. I think I'm done. I think I'm done here. Unless... If I go for it now... Nice. No, smite. Come on, come on. Retribution. Oh my god, I'm alive. I'm alive, 2 HP, come on! Oh my god, no! Retribution, no! And his prayer fell. That could have been a, ret a retribution smite kill right there. Oh, that was so close. First death of the day, but oh, I've suicided then. That combo was so nice. Oh, man. I was unlucky. I could have got him then. I could have got him then, but I'm definitely going to rematch him if he comes back. Same odds, because I smited him like twice that fight. That is a whip. That is a whip that's on the line there. And I think I'm two games of pest control away from actually finishing my void, so that's quite nice. But anyways, I'll be back in a second when I go and get my untweetables back. Five shocks. Okay, we've got a rematch. Same odds. Smite is up. Well, unfortunately, I don't actually have a D-Long anymore, so this commentary kind of is now a misleading title. I want you to just dislike the video now. So this is probably going to be my last fight of the video, and hopefully we can turn this into a nice one where I give you all a little teaser of what is to come next when I hit very high with my Draconical Mace, and we get ourselves potentially a whip smite. You never actually know what's going to happen. Oh, that would have been a good time to go for it, because if I hit a 30, could have stacked straight after 38 with the... Um with the, uh, whatever it's called. Uh-oh. Okay, this is bad. Prayer is very low. Prayer is actually very low here, so... Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. We're all good, though. So we tank that. And we should be able to get a slice in here. Ah, oh, that could have killed him. And his prayer's probably extremely low here as well, because he's been... That's what I always say. He's comboing me that bad that he doesn't watch his prayer for a bit, which means suddenly he's dead. If I had a Kawambwan, if I had a Kawambwan, we would have had him there. There we go. as the whip smite. Come on. Zero. I'm not a strength party, so I can't do anything. Well, I could have, but... It wouldn't have been worth the risk. Come on, Mace. 37. Just as he gets smite up. Just as he gets smite up. Unless he puts smite on first. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. I could so get a whip, but every... I just smited him again. Like, what happened in the first fight? I smited him at times when I can't actually capitalize on the fact that his prayer drops without panicking. Like, I didn't have a strength pot in my deal. I could have gone for it, but there was high odds that it wouldn't have actually happened. But... Whatever. Anyways, guys, um, as we can see there, the D-Mace currently has 100% accuracy with its specs. I'm going to end the commentary here. Uh, we got a whip smite in here, so honestly, this video is great. I mean, that whip smite made th that whip smite made this video awesome, to put it that way. Now, the commentary probably not the best, because I woke up and I was absolutely dead, but I decided want to get a PK commentary out before I start live streaming today, so I've done that. Anyways, that's the first whip smite I've got on a video, so I'm pretty damn happy about that one. So, yeah, thank you for watching, guys. I will see you all in the next video. I think I just got my void, but I'm in another game, so we will see in a second if I've got it or not. But yeah, that's this video, guys. So next video will probably be a D Mace, unless I decide to make a different type of commentary. But yeah, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. See you all soon.